everyone. Today we're going to be discussing the fourth stage of the cell cycle where our cell division takes place. This stage is called mitosis, in which a single body cell divides into two identical daughter cells, each containing 46 chromosomes. According to Hank from Crash Course, mitosis, which was discovered by Walter Fleming, is a process where cell nuclei split and move away from each other, forming two new cells. Each cell contains a nucleus, and that nucleus stores your DNA, which contains your genetic, genetic information. And your DNA is organized into 46 chromosomes, 23 pairs, one from each parent. And a cell that contains 46 chromosomes is called a diploid cell. In order for the daughter cells to be identical, the chromosomes must be duplicated and interphase before mitosis even begins. During interphase, the cell is growing, replicating DNA, protein synthesis is occurring, and the cells are carrying out its normal function. In interphase, you can't see the chromosomes, which normally look like this, because the DNA looks like coiled up chromatin, which look like this, which will eventually condense during prophase. Now, there are many purposes of mitosis. Some include growth, repairing damage. So when you get an injury and after a couple of days it heals up, that can be attributed to mitosis. Cell regeneration and asexual reproduction, where as you see here, starts with one cell which moves apart from each other, splits into two identical new cells, which we call daughter cells. This is all for Mitosis Part 1 lecture. Thank you all for watching, and I hope you learned as much as I did. Thank you.